All right, welcome. Uh, in this video, we will uh, look at how to wire up a simple NOT gate. Uh, what we'll do is uh, connect our switch uh, to a 7404 uh, IC, uh, and then uh, use the output of the IC uh, to uh, connect to the LED to visualize the output. Okay, so the goal is to connect a inverter or a NOT gate. So let's start with a switch. So here I have a, a four uh, switch dip packets. Uh, we'll just wire one of them uh, as a pull-up resistor. So I'm going to put this on the breadboard. Now to do that, rotate it, and I'm going to do put it right here on the top. Okay. All right. So I have that now right there on the top. So uh, we need a pull-up resistor. Uh, we typically use a one kilo ohm uh, resistor to do the pull-up uh, portion of it. So Let's connect this resistor right here uh, to pin one. Okay, and I'll connect that directly to the plus power line. Uh, pin one is connected. Now, next thing what we'll do is we'll bring in this IC and place this IC. Uh, pin seven of the IC right here is supposed to be connected to ground. So let me connect that to ground with a green wire. Uh, pin 14 of the IC is supposed to be connected to power, so what I'll do is I'll connect that to the power line right here, and I'll change the color of that wire to red. Okay, let me use a red wire to do this. Uh, all right, good. So I have a red wire powered up, uh, powering up the IC, a green wire providing ground to this IC. Now on the switch, one side of the switch is connected through a one kilo ohm resistor to a plus side. Now we'll grab a wire from here and bring it into pin one. And I'll make this wire a different color. So let's call it orange. So that'll be the input wire. So this will be the input. The output of this will go into an LED. So an LED with a cathode and an anode. So We'll put our LED this way, right here. The cathode part of the LED will connect to ground. So let me grab a green wire and connect that to ground, like that. Uh, the anode part of the LED will use a 330, 300 ohm or 330 ohm current limiting resistor, connect that to the anode. And the other end of that resistor will connect it to pin 2 uh, of that uh, 7404 NOT gate and I will make that a I'll make it a instead of orange let me make that a, let's say a purple color okay so that's the input coming into the 7748 co 4 that'll be the output and we'll visualize that output on that LED right here okay uh, the other side of the switch the switch is not fully complete right now so we have a pull up out the other side of the switch will connect to ground as well. So there's my ground. Okay. So I have my ground uh, and everything set up. Now I need to power this particular breadboard. So let me bring in a, uh, a, a, a five volt power supply. So power a five volt power supply. So I'm going to bring in a power supply right here and connect the red part of the power supply to my red line on the breadboard and my negative terminal of the power supply or the ground to the black right here like this. So this is now powered. If we turn this, we'll be able to turn this on, uh, supply a five volt uh, from there. So if I had simulate, so I have five volt connected to the power supply, it's now turned on. With this switch, it's down, so the light's currently off. When I turn it up, light turn on. When I do it down, light go off. When I turn it on, light go on. So wired up uh, a, a switch with a pull-up uh, current limiting uh, resistor together with an LED and a 74HC04.